Um, about two years, I started training jiu-jitsu about a little over two years ago and I jumped into competition almost right away, so about two years. You know, I, I think the biggest thing that I came away with from all the experience in tournaments as a white belt was um, the ability to compete with the same mentality that I take into training. You can't go into, into a tournament and, you know, get nervous and uh, overexcited. I really had to stay calm and treat it just like I did another day of training and that's when I really made the, the big jump in technique and eventually got the blue belt. Um, as a white belt, I did about one tournament a month. Now I'm getting a little more frequent, um, almost every weekend, give or take a few. Um, but as a white belt, yeah, about one a month. Um, I had a lot of fun. I think the pace at Purple Belt seemed a little different. Um, this was, of course, my only experience, but uh, it seemed like the Purple Belts used a little more technique. The pace was uh, a little bit uh, faster, tighter game, more technique involved. Where at Blue Belt, you know, some of the guys go a little crazy, maybe if it's their first tournament or something like that. But uh, I had a lot of fun today. Yeah, I mean, just get in there and compete. You know, you'll learn a lot about yourself in competition. You know, you can make this, a lot of mistakes in, uh, in class or in training. And, you know, you might not learn anything or take anything away from those mistakes. But if you make a mistake in a tournament, it'll probably be the last time you ever make it. You know, so it's, it's really a great thing to do. Get in there, see how you do. You'll learn a lot about yourself in the process and, and have a, hopefully have a lot of fun. You know, keep your head up. Uh, stay calm when you're out there. It's just another day of training. Extremely important. I mean, I, I always try to film all of my fights from tournaments. That's one of the biggest things. Go back to the drawing board on Monday, get those videos up, and, and check out where you, what you did wrong, what you did right. And you know, it, it almost seems like I always learn a lot more from the losses than the wins. You know, always seeing what you did wrong, how can you correct that? You know, and that's what's great having a good instructor. You can always go to him, ask for help, show him what you did wrong, and, and he'll always be there to help you.